Easter is coming up fast, and with COVID cases rising in some parts of the country, you might wonder how safe is it to gather. KPI's 5 Joss Moran took that concern to health experts. With a lot of holidays in this pandemic, we've really had to think about our risks. Right now, even though cases are rising, health experts say cases are not nearly where they were at in January during the peak of Omicron, at least here in the Bay Area. With a lot of restrictions now lifted, if we walk into a store or a public place, many have their masks off. It's looking different than this time last year, and even more so from two years ago. Some people are feeling more comfortable being out in gatherings this Easter. I think the first year we were all stuck at home, so it's just nice to, to like be invited like hey come over instead of like oh I'll just FaceTime you. <laughs> We all remember those FaceTime calls this year. While we are seeing an uptick in COVID cases, health experts say hospitalizations remain low. So UCSF Infectious Disease Specialist Dr. Peter Chin Hong is giving a couple of things to keep in mind ahead of your gathering this weekend. Think about the people who are going. Is everyone vaccinated plus boosted? Do those who are older have their second booster? And you can also think about doing an at-home rapid test right before your gathering. And he says that the weather is nice. Think about moving it outside. That may not be a bad idea. And I think this is uh, one of the safest Easter's even though those numbers are increasing and it's safer for uh, many reasons. The first reason is that we have more tools to protect ourselves. And we talked about some of those tools, vaccination being a big one. But Dr. Chen Hong says it comes down to thinking about your risks. In the newsroom, I'm Jocelyn Moran, KPIX 5.